Welcome back guys. Uh, today I'm doing a video that was requested by one of our viewers and uh, basically it is how to install Broadcom drivers within Manjaro. So I'm going to go through that. It's not going to take long. Manjaro as usual makes it extremely easy. Um, if you were running plain Arch <clears throat> you would have to open up a terminal and uh, make sure you add Yawert <clears throat> into Plain Arch. Manjaro does that for you, but if you're running Plain Arch, then of course you need to add it yourself. So once you have Yawert set up, then you're going to do a search on Broadcom. <clears throat> now I'm showing you this because um, in within Manjaro, they break it down for you by the kernel that you're running. If you were in Arch, it would only you would only have Broadcom WL. So if you're in Arch, you're going to use Yawert Broadcom WL. But we're not in Plain Arch. We're in Manjaro, and Manjaro makes it even easier. <clears throat> so as I said, if you are in Manjaro, then you will do a search for Yawert Broadcom and you will pick the kernel that you're running. So in order to find out what you're running, just type uname slash r. It'll show you the kernel. I'm running 4.4. So if I go into my terminal and I look at Broadcom, I want to find 44, 4.4. So here we have number 9. Now this is a fresh install of the Manjaro Mate GTK2 version. I'm going to install the four Linux 44 Broadcom WL. But, so in order to do that, I need to know the package number. It's nine. We're going to enter nine. Press enter, enter your password. Proceed with in installation, yes. Before you install your Broadcom, if you, if you have a fresh install of um, Manjaro, what you should do is run run this command sudo pacman dash mirrors space dash lowercase g run that it will test all of the mirrors available uh, within your system and it will measure the speed and clean up your mirror list so that you're using only the fastest now this does not work in Arch. This is a Manjaro exclusive command. So I recommend you run that whenever you do a Manjaro fresh install. Run that. If you haven't done it yet and you're run running Manjaro, then just go ahead and run that before you do your next update. You'll find that your update process is much faster. So that's sudo space pacman dash mirrors space dash lowercase g very important command so once you have installed your Linux Broadcom for your particular kernel then you're gonna close out and you're going to reboot that means I'm gonna have to reboot guys I'll be right back with you now it just so you if you if we look in my um, network manager you'll see I only have a wired connection at this point so I'm going to reboot and then we'll check to see if Broadcom is installed so I'll be right back with you guys okay guys I am back and let's check to see if we have any Broadcom Wi-Fi networks available and as you can see we do so now we just need to select the one I want to connect to 
enter my password and it will go ahead and connect should be connecting and we are now connected so now if I disconnect my wired you'll see my Wi-Fi shows up I am connected to my Wi-Fi network it's as easy as that guys uh, so if you uh, if you have a Broadcom Wi-Fi card that'll be the easiest way to install install your drivers and get it working within Manjaro so that is it guys please rate comment and subscribe thank you for stopping by the channel and I will see you soon take care